In this video, I'll show you the cross-references navigation plugin for Obsidian. So I organize the notes in my vault with a handful of tags. Let's say I've found an interesting article that I want to read soon. I might drop it into a new note, give it a title, and add the appropriate tags. I might have a tag for the author, the topic, um, and it is something that I would like to read next. And let's say that the article sparked a new thought on something I'd like to write. I can start another new note. and give it the right tags as well. And I might stub out some initial thoughts. So my vault is filled with notes like these, my writing, thinking, things that I'm reading, tagged according to their status, topic, and so on. Let's open the cross-reference navigation view. In here, you'll see my references cloud. This view organizes all of my notes according to the tags that I use and the most common cross-references among them. So under each tag, I can see my most recent notes and the most common cross-references among the notes with that tag. If I look under reading, I can see that my new note, you and your research, is right here. And under writing, the other note that I just created is right here. Different views become important parts of my daily workflow. For example, in progress becomes my workspace of everything that I'm learning, working on, or developing my thinking on right now. I could even filter into one specific topic if I wanted to. Up next is fertile ground for new things to learn or work on. Done becomes a nicely organized archive. If I go to writing, Plus, in progress, I can see everything that I'm writing right now. A newsletter, a lab note, an essay. I can see everything pertaining to specific people. If I open thinking, I can see everything that I'm thinking about organized by status. What I'm finished with, what I'm working on now, and what I'd like to develop my thinking on next. If I want to find something that I know I've finished reading, I could click Reading plus Done, and I can see everything broken out in here by person, by author, and by topic. If I want to go back to everything tagged with reading, I can just click here. Uh, I could see what's up next in reading, and if I wanted to go to everything that's up next beyond just what's in reading, I can Command click here, and Up Next becomes the new base tag, so I can see what I have up next in reading, writing, and thinking, and broken out by other tags as well. I could mark the groups that I use most to organize my things, which prioritizes them in the main list and in the lists of cross-references. And your tags can be anything. These are just what I've made mine. You might have a group for different projects or clients, for example. It's a very flexible system that can be made fairly complex or kept fairly simple, depending on your needs. And it all just runs off of uh, the tags that you add into your notes. So this is the first look at the plugin that explores the concepts laid out in my 15th lab note on cross-references navigation. You can try out the plugin for yourself. I hope you enjoy it.